there's a lot of people out here that want to know what they need to start their own t-shirt business. One of the first things that you need to figure out is your business name. That that's something you should do from a jump. In the beginning stages of your business, you need to come up with a logo. You can, your logo can just be your business name. That's it. So the next thing you need to do is pick a niche. Like what type of shirts do you want to sell? Are you going to sell military shirts? Are you going to sell Christian shirts? Shirts for people that love dolphins that like mountain climbing? What type of apparel are you going to sell? Are you going to just sell t-shirts? Are you going to do long sleeve, hoodies, v-necks, whatever? And another important question to ask yourself is, are you going to have your own inventory? Or you can use uh, print on demand companies where all you have to do is design, give the design to that, that business or company. They'll print your design on their apparel for you and they'll ship it out to your customers. All right, there's also a method called drop shipping, but uh, it, it, it can be a little bit more complex because of the apparel sizing. But uh, with that method, you also, you do not have to have your own inventory. A business license. If you have a business license, you're able to get apparel at wholesale prices. So in other words, you get them cheaper. And also, if you plan on doing events, like you know festivals or conferences and stuff like that, some, some of these event coordinators require you to have a business license. In this day and age, you got to have a website. You got to have a website. You can have someone design it for you. It just may be a little bit more expensive, or you can go to like places like GoDaddy, Wix, Shopify, WordPress. There's a whole bunch of other ones out there also that you can use. Just load your content onto their onto their page and they charge you like maybe $20, $30 a month. You also want to uh, start learning about advertising because even if you have a website, you gotta be able to drive people to your website. I mean, you can start a Facebook page, you got, you got Instagram, you got Twitter, you got tons of social media outlets out here nowadays. Most of these social media sites have uh, ads, an ad service. You got Facebook ad, Twitter ad, Instagram ads. You also want to look around your local area, your local city, and look up events that you can actually sell your apparel at. You're gonna need a desktop computer or a laptop a printer, blank apparel, some type of heat press machine, and if you are a designer, you're gonna need some designing software. All right, so that's the short and sweet version of what you need to start your own t-shirt business. Like I said, I didn't go into much detail, but I'll have videos in the future where I break everything down a little bit more and I go in more detail about certain uh, components. <clears throat> if you subscribe to my page, my information should be down on the bottom of the video right now. And uh, I also go over some of the equipment that I use. Um, there's tons of equipment out there. I mentioned you need printers, you need you know, software, you need laptop, desktop. I'll go over the stuff that I use, but by no means do you have to use what I use. I'm definitely not telling you to do everything that I do, but you definitely do everything you want for your business. Get the equipment you want for your business. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to my page.